Justin, can you explain this device to me, man? How does this thing help you out? Yeah, so I use something called a beeper box, and uh -huh. what it does is it gives me audible signals so I know either where the coping will be, I'll either put it at the end, uh, the top of a coping or at the end of a rail or ledge, yeah. and it's just it's as simple as okay. it sounds. Just a box wow. that beeps. And, and it gives, obviously it gets louder as you get closer, yep. and you're like, all right. Yeah, yeah, box. so it gives me about like about a foot and a half. I can get pretty precise within a foot and a half. Wow. So I use that, and then I have my uh, rolling ball tip. Yep. Like this isn't normal. That's this is for like uh, runners, blind runners. But oh, I okay. found out like using it for skateboarding is good. But if you notice, it breaks pretty easy. I did yeah, that just yeah. today. Oh, but wow. uh, and then that lets me know where coping is and where the ledges are, and as well. So wow. that's yeah. it. Man, that reminds me of you, Oscar, saying how you would be breaking prosthetics right. and stuff because they yeah. are like made for skateboarding yeah. and falling like that. That's yeah, I think sick. The yeah. common motif of the adaptive skaters is like, you know, we just persevere and just try to make do with whatever we yeah. have and just because we love skateboarding, man, yeah. and then we're just yeah. adap yeah. adapting to it. Yeah. It's, it's Damn, funny, like awesome. when you uh, become an adaptive skater, your best sponsor is not a skateboard sponsor, it's a cane sponsor. Yeah. I bet yeah. like Or a uh, leg sponsor. A leg sponsor. Or a leg sponsor. Yeah. Yeah. Call it leg. fart. Call it yeah. fart. Yeah. Yeah, nice. like that's what it is. Ambutech. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Well, thanks yeah. for coming, you guys. Yeah, man. thank you. We love you, Porter. We love you, Grind for Life. Porter, we love you guys. Thanks, dude.